Hey everybody, it's Monday, January 15th in the evening, and um, Hearthstone showed a bunch more cards for the mini set, Showdown in the Badlands, and there's some cool ones here I'm pretty excited about. I just want to go through them all and talk about them. Um, let's see here. The new Hunter and Death Knight cards. One mana, arcane spell, shimmer shot. Deal one damage and summon a random minion of that cost. That's cool. Um, arcane is cool. It's probably going to be seen in arcane decks trying to push that out um i'm interested in seeing how this one uh goes and um yeah i mean the the hunter cards i play uh the hunter decks i play right now are mostly just highlander or what have you so this will be interesting to see this play um the next one is a hunter and death knight um, dual card and it's a three mana mismatch fossils and it's discover a beast and an undead and swap their stats this one i'm excited about i'm excited about seeing what combinations can come up with to be pretty fun and funky and i will be messing around with this one absolutely in both hunter and uh, death knight and then here is another dual class card six mana four six elemental obsidian revenant it's taunt and the death rattle is summoned two Two random death rattle minions that cost three or less there's gonna be some cool stuff on this one as well um i haven't looked at any of the other opportunities there for death rattle cards but i, I like all of these options i like that it's being used in death knight or hunter so this one will be really cool to see um play i'm excited for these uh next up is the mage and hunter cards they were also revealed today uh three mana mage spell summoning ward it's a secret when your turn starts summon a copy of your highest cost minion um i'm gonna have to wait and see on this one i'm not really sure what's going on with that one um it looks cool i saw that uh twitter was saying yeah that looks pretty neat um i just don't know yet and then a um dual class mage hunter spell three mana elemental companion summon a random elemental companion and then i have the companions right here there's hifar which is a three mana four two elemental your spells cost one less that will be useful for mage. It'll probably be useful for hunter as well. And then there's look, and I'm probably pronouncing that incorrectly. It's a three mana, two, four elemental with spell damage plus two. That could work across the board for both hunter and mage. And then there's Misho or Mesho, a uh, three mana, four, four elemental can't be targeted by spells or hero powers. That has some opportunities in both hunter and mage and then you know this is summon a random so you're not going to be able to pick anything specific it looks cool um i'm just you know i, I i'm not seeing mage is kind of getting the short end of the stick i could be wrong on this um on all of the cards revealed so far i just i'm not excited in mage as some of the other classes and then the last one for the mage and hunter dual class cards a five mana five five elemental naga mantle shaper cost one less for each spell you've cast while holding this that's cool um especially for mage um, I just don't know. I, I mean, listen, there's an elemental mage right now, so this might be really cool to be in those decks. Um, I would consider uh, messing around with that in elemental mage, but time will tell. And now for the ones I'm really interested in, really excited to see Death Knight has been um, one of my favorite classes right now, and Paladin is strong, and it's been one of my favorite classes as a whole. Um, so listen, Death Knight Paladin cards, we'll go through that. Uh, four mana, three, three weapon, Quartzite Crusher and it's Lifesteal. Freeze any character damaged by your hero. I like this one. I like that there's Lifesteal on it. I'm going to be trying this out. This is a Blood Frost Rune. Um, and next one is a dual class. Uh, Death Knight and Paladin. 3 mana, 3 1 mech. Prosthetic Hand and the Magnetic with Reborn can magnetize to mechs or undead. This is going in Death Knight decks that I'm playing with right now. 100%. I love that. If it had lifesteal, it'd be an amazing thing. No, it's fine. It's fine. You could do a lot with this. I feel like this one's going to be useful in both Mage and Death Knight, but I'm most excited for this to be in Death Knight. And then the last one, two mana Death Knight Paladin dual class card, Mining Casualties. Summon two 1-1 one, one Silverhand Recruits with Death Rattle. Summon a 1-1 one, one Frail Ghoul. The, the, the Frail Ghoul is the 
the the normal one that you get when you're running through um, the the game. So at the end of your turn, this minion dies, kind of like we normally see right now. It's the one mana one one undead. I'm excited for all of these cards. I'm going to be trying every single one of them. Um, we're almost done with reveals. Once reveals are done, I'll probably spend my time um, going through and like kind of rating all of them once I see everything at once. So stay tuned for that. And remember, the mini set's coming in just a couple of days. Uh, Thursday, it'll be announced. Today's Monday. And then don't forget, if you look at the video that I will link below, that is the mini set giveaway that I'm doing. All you have to do is be subscribed to the channel and then like and comment. And I'll pick a winner the day before or maybe even even uh, do it on tomorrow sometime. So thanks a lot for watching and see you in the next video.